Hi, I'm Erin Wassinger, and I'm here with my co-author, Sarah Arthur, and we have written a book called The Year of Small Things, Radical Faith for the Rest of Us, which comes out from Brazos Press in January 2017. So the story behind the story is that when my husband Tom and I were students in seminary at Duke Divinity School in Durham, North Carolina, we lived in an intentional Christian community. And so we did that for three years and practiced many of, um, kind of some ancient monastic practices that are known as new monasticism now. And those included things like um, communal living, obviously, um, contemplative spiritual practices, um, sustainability, simplicity, hospitality to strangers. So that was our context for three years. And then our bishop, uh, my husband's a United Methodist pastor, our bishop appointed us to a suburban congregation in Lansing, Michigan. And we pulled up at our suburban parsonage, which looks like every other house on our block. Um, to immaculate lawn care, values of well-dressed children, cars that are not rusting away, excellent schools, um, single-family home, um, somewhat conspicuous consumption, and all of a sudden we realized that this was, this was a whole new world. Right. Now, Dave and I, we did not live in an intentional community. Um, Dave and I were employed, both of us, at um, a newspaper in Wisconsin. And when Dave's job took us to Lansing, Michigan, that's about the time when I started reading Shane Claiborne and David Platt and Jonathan Wilson Hartgrove. And as I was, as I was reading these with three small children wrangling around my, my legs, asking for snacks, um, it, it occurred to me that I had no idea how to actually do this, especially alone. And so that we began to have conversations about the books we were reading and questions about our practices as families, particularly with young kids. Um, like, do you just take the marks of new monasticism and just like add with kids on the end and then just like it all works? Right. Uh, and so we settled eventually on a commitment to one another and covenant friendship as families um, to take 12 months, a full year, where we would take a different practice each month uh, born out of new monasticism and conversations with those communities and begin to translate those practices. What, what one small thing could we do each month? And when we get together, we talk about how are things going um, with your finances? How are things going um, with a disciplined, contemplative, spiritual life with small children? With small children. So we took one, each family, uh, took a practice and translated it for that one month and we added those cumulatively we, over the year and it became the year of small things. So we're discerning that this is what radical faith for the rest of us looks like. I'm Erin Wassinger. And I'm Sarah Arthur and we're the authors of the year of small things, radical faith for the rest of us coming out from Brazos Press, January 2017. And you can follow along at yearofsmallthings.com.